Hello friends and welcome to my YouTube channel Simply Stocks and today I am going to talk about Dr. Lal Path Labs. It is a long term dark horse. I give you the reasons and why I believe that it can be a multi bagger from these levels. So let's get started. First of all a disclaimer that this is not a stock recommendation. People taking any position to any share that I talk about should do that with their own due diligence and research and I am not in favor or against any company that I talk about. Before I talk about Dr. Lal Path Labs, here's a small request that kindly support me on Patreon and once you do that it will help me grow the channel, help you also ask me questions in greater detail. Once you get the $10 membership, you'll have access to my portfolio, my watch list and number of podcasts that I put up from time to time. And also if you can pay $100 upfront, you get one year access by paying for 10 months so that's a 20% discount. For detailed market or company talk directly contact me and we can work things out with a fee and also if you cannot pay through credit card there you can pay through paypal on patreon coming to the company dr lal path labs was established in 1949 and they provide medical testing services and one of the fastest growing lab brand in india in fact i remember that over the last 12 13 years it has grown tremendously uh, from 2006 7 onwards and with the pandemic around it has also got the pivot or uh, that alpha to really build up and scale up and have more cash on books a stellar brand in its domain uh, will benefit with the lifestyle change that is taking place i'll discuss about it later on in this presentation the market cap of the uh, company is around 28000 crores which i believe is less for such a business that uh, what dr lal is doing if you look at the financials and these are q4 numbers or the april march quarter numbers for fy21 compared to last year sales went up by 41 percent and that had to go up so remember that march 2020 was probably the final quarter uh, before the pandemic and this one had pandemic albeit less in the jan to march quarter the profit went up and jumped up substantially by 265 percent to 83 crores versus 32 crores it is a zero debt company uh, the dividend payout is a strong a uh, high promoter and institutional holding with around 11 percent free float so all in all looks a very strong stock and these are the kind of stocks i really like which have run up but consolidate and which have a lot of potential going forward so it is not that you can say that okay it has gone up from being a 10,000 crore market cap to 30,000 crores so it cannot rise more you have to look at the potential and potential in testing uh, you can say kits companies in testing companies in in you can sell anything related to medicine medical uh, would rise as as people's age increase and india become a an aging population going forward return on equity of 25 percent is pretty good and operating profit margin of 28 percent tells you that the company is operationally very efficient a debt-free company that is doing extremely well if you look at the performance of the stock then it doubled in under 12 months in fact it has gone up even further more than doubled 120 percent in less than 12 months operational performance has been pretty good in fact it has significantly improved partly because of operational efficiency and working online and working through labs which are like you can say we have takeaway restaurants so th these are takeaway tests that you bring in tests here some of the tests that you take so you take samples at home and, and bring in and they test or these are with with lower you can say lesser real estate space uh, these labs are which I have seen in my city and that has also helped in cutting down cost uh, so a lot of things have gone on over the last uh, two three years uh, for the company in order to cut down cost and that has uh, been shown through the operational performance that the company has produced results have been robust and it had hot to ought to be uh, robust with the kind of scenario that we are in uh, strong holdings no debt high return ratios all extremely good in fact the stock has risen recently even more and i think yes there has been a plethora of uh, path lab companies that have come up or laboratories that have come up but many will shut down as as things uh, become better but what will happen is this brand will remain so there are very few brands that are there so the brand value of the company will 
will will continue to be there and people like to call and get their things tested something like a thyroid or diabetes etc they they get it tested by with a call and and the person from dr lal comes in and tests you this facility is is a remarkable change in in you can say medical testing uh, uh, you can scenario and this is going to take things forward uh, for the company as a whole current health situation has helped the numbers and i believe that people will become more uh, sensitive going forward so why i believe it can be 4x in the next 5 years i believe that it can easily be 1.2 1.3 lakh crores over the next 4 5 years a demand for testing at home being more convenient and safe will only increase and this is something that people will get used to if people are saying that people that that most of the people will order online more even though when things open up so zomato will do well i say this this sector as a whole the testing sector whether it is metropolis dr lal apollo and many other you can say companies uh, they will continue to do well and perform very well and there is hardly any competition there are, there are other other brands but very few you can say renowned brand and dr lal is among the best so this demand for testing at home will only increase and people will get more convenient doing that rather than going somewhere for for a test or buying some equipment monthly one one day they can call up uh, uh, the person from uh, the company and uh, get everybody tested and you'll have it Uh, within a day or two, you'll get get the results. At this point of time, you're getting results in four or five days. I think within a day, you get the results. Uh, I know that uh, the uh, testing for some of the you can say uh, some of the most common uh, you can say uh, illnesses like diabetes or thyroid. You get the reports within six seven hours, so you don't have to wait a lot uh, for that by evening you get it so it's extremely convenient and i believe that you need to look at this shift and this is the shift that is happening in this field and this will continue to only get better going forward lifestyle and demography uh, will prompt more testing and more business uh, i think now oh, people will be more aware of their health so there will be more testing no matter what happens this is a complete change to what has been happening since till 2018 and 19 and people will uh, try to be become more fit here in india so that is a uh, you can say a positive of what comes out of this situation that we are in and people will look to get more healthier and and for that they need to get more tested frequently over a period of time so those who are not being tested at all who are not concerned about uh, getting tested for uh, their overall health uh, will will be getting into it yearly or six monthly and those who are doing it may do it more frequently so so this all will bring in more you can say business for for the company huge opportunity to expand in india this is one of the biggest reasons why i believe this company can be huge so this company normally is in south in sorry normally is in north and west india uh, majorly they are in north india very less in south i believe it has huge potential to expand into south and west india uh, the southern or western southern uh, portion and also i they would be bound to do that they are not doing it at the moment and which is a kind of a good thing but eventually say 2 3 4 years down the line the expansion could be there and once they expand the potential could be enormous whatever they are doing it could become 3 4x uh, the the kind of sales that they are doing yes there will be more expenses they would have to look at everything but i think expansion uh, would be the name of the game going forward 4 5 years down the line and that is going to bring in a lot of sales so expansion is one thing that we need to look at and that could bring in a lot of sales for the company and that would be the driver for the next big move in in the stock a sustainable growing business with high margins which increases in distress unfortunately that is the case and this is something that we need to be concerned about yet invest wisely uh, i believe that this is a sea change what is happening at the moment and illnesses is a part and parcel of one's life with the lifestyle that we are living in and this is unfortunate but true what is happening so 
I would say their business will continue to grow because of the lifestyle that most of the people in the urban areas are living and above the age of 40 50 if we don't take care of our health we know we are we, where we are headed and unfortunately that is the case uh, these businesses may just keep on growing so sales can expand substantially once it goes pan india and with the kind of lifestyle that most of the people are living uh, i think the growth potential for uh, the company is immense over the next four or five years if you look at the technicals of the stock then there is strong support around the 303100 level so any major declines towards 303100 it is a buy 2700 could be a strong stop loss for long term basis people would have bought at 27 2800 keep a stop loss at 2700 keep on holding buy on declines to 3000 currently the stock is closer to 3400 so any 5-7% decline is a good buying opportunity even at current levels it can be bought this is headed much higher from here this is what I am seeing on the charts there is no sign of weakness and I believe that with with the news of the third wave maybe it would not be that severe there will be more testing and also i think for the next two years uh you can you you should be rest assured that the business will continue to flourish uh may consolidate right now as pandemic has reduced testing has reduced so maybe the september quarter will not be that uh, big uh it may continue to consolidate in a 10 percent range but then the move could be huge uh, once things get going again so buy on major declines buy at current levels and then on declines it has run up a lot so there has to be some consolidation which is taking place uh, but i think the next level to look at is 4400 on the stock in the in a year's time so what needs to be done can be bought on major declines can we can, you can buy 10 15 percent of the total holding at current levels also uh, remember I, I i truly believe that 28 30 000 crore market cap is extremely less for such a business it can be one and a half two lakh crores if, if it expands over the next four five years and have less than five percent exposure initially into such stocks So this was my video on Dr. Lal Path Labs. Please like and subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so you can get my videos straight away when I post it and kindly support me on Patreon. Thanks a lot for watching.